blessed people of God. As y'all can see, I'm uh, getting ready to prepare these overnight nut oats and eat them for breakfast. Uh, this was on Friday. Friday was an extremely busy day for me, so I'm getting ready to heat this up, and it was delicious. All right, y'all, just a quick Instacart order. But anyway, I got a yellow bell pepper. I'm going to be making a taco soup in the crock pot. So I need a yellow bell pepper, green bell pepper. I've got me some uh, celery because I've been craving ants on a log, which is celery, peanut butter, sprinkled with some ants. Um, ants. Spr <laughs> sprinkled with raisins. <laughs> Um, this is some uh, cream cheese for the taco soup, cottage cheese, um, some shrimp scampi. Um, I don't know why I just didn't get some regular shrimp and just season it up. But anyway, I've, I want, I've always wanted to try this just to see. I got me some more of this light and fit Greek yogurt. Y'all, this is really excellent and it's very high in protein. I am... Um, uh, eating a lot of protein because I'm starting to lift weights just a little bit to gain muscle. Now, y'all, I haven't lost any weight. I actually have gained two pounds. Yeah, but I'm doing a balance because I'm starting to tone up that muscle under my skin even more. So I'm taking in a little bit more protein. So anyway, I love love this great great flavor and i got the uh cheese strawberry and cheesecake again i got me some uh sweet corn again for the taco soup i got a packet of the chili seasoning to go in it um i got some um spaghetti and linguine to do uh with the shrimp scampi loving this protein milk again love it love it love it so got some of that of course my favorite apple juice i'm going to be making a um tur breast turkey breast tenderloin um i'm gonna cook this in the crock pot as well um and just slow cook it so i can just slice it up so i have this um to eat because i thought you know what i'm not finna buy no processed meat i'm gonna just get this all natural t tenderloin and just uh lightly season it and just slice it up and eat it that way um again some tomato paste for the taco soup i got some rotel diced tomatoes um i got a roasted fire roasted can and just a regular can and then i got two cans of black beans and like i said i'm gonna make a big batch of this and whatever i have left over um, i'm just gonna put it in some quart uh freezer bags and then whenever i want some i just pull it out so i got two cans of these and um no salt added and then i just got some more garlic powder i got some cooking wine and some uh, Pama Ajana Chiz. And that's the quick haul for this week. I got plenty of fruits and vegetables in there, so I'm pretty good with that. Hey y'all, this was actually late in the day on Friday. That overnight oatmeal really held me throughout the day. And so I just fixed this. And that was it for Friday. I did a Friday night live. So for those of you who tuned in, we had a good time Friday night. Um, I watched a couple of episodes of, um, what was it, Game of Thrones? Or no, excuse me, House of the Dragons. And uh, when I woke up this morning, I thought, oh, wow, it rained all night long or throughout the night. Didn't even know I slept like a little baby. But anyway, it's Saturday morning. And we tell the Lord, thank you for his reign. But y'all know what's up. It's time to make the coffee. Now, y'all, this is a new one. I've never tried this. This uh, Grinch Frosted Sugar and Cookies OMG tastes so good to me. So, yep, I'm rocking that probably for now throughout the holidays. <laughs> Love it.
I'm going to show y'all something I saw on TikTok and never thought to do. When you open up tomato paste, you know it's always really thick. Just go ahead on and, uh, you know, when you, unless, you know, you've got a pop top. But just go ahead on and take off and unseal the top and the bottom. Of course, you wipe your cans off. But... And then, see right here at the bottom, you're going to unseal the whole thing too and just push it through. Is that not neat? And voila, all of it's out. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> red lobster butter cheddar garlic biscuits yeah and have no fear i'm gonna be sharing this with my family i talked to tony today i'm gonna be dropping him off some uh taco soup um and uh a couple of biscuits so uh and also my mom and Kareem. So, no, your girl ain't finna tackle all this and eat all this by herself. I'm going to share the love. All right, y'all, let's get into it. And this is simple. Uh, uh, you can buy that uh, uh, recipe right out of the store. They sell it. It's a box. It's just flour. You have to add cheese and butter. Um. Or you can make it from scratch, and I put some garlic powder in it. Simple as one through three. Patty cake, patty cake, baker's man, roll them up, roll them up, put them on the pan. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you.